What's up, guys? We're here at the Moxie Hotel. I have Masabella with me. So we actually been here for like a day or two, and we're packing up and leaving. There's my wig, girl. Yes, my Birkin and my video I was working on. I think it's almost. Yeah, I think it's ready. About to post it in a minute. Um, first of all, we do get a TV. I don't know what brand television it is. Uh, maybe the remote tells me. Do you see the remote anywhere by the, any chance? And so, let me show you the view. So, this is the Moxie Hotel. It is is Los Angeles, California, newest hotel. It's connected to the AC Hotel. So, in essence, uh, there's two hotels in one. AC is like the business side, and the Moxie is like the fun, hip, younger side. Um, so, it's right next to the Crypto Arena. I'll show you this right here. There's Crypto Arena. And that used to be the Staples Center, I believe. It even says on the top, Crypto Arena. And then up there, you can see the Hollywood Hills. And you have the Ritz-Carlton, the JW Marriott, which I found that kind of interesting, too, that the Ritz-Carlton and JW Marriott are basically like connected. Um, and then down there, you have Hotel Figueroa. And then this, you have like this little plaza that lights up really nice at night with like little shops and stuff right there. So everything's like pretty much on this street. There's a lot of construction going on. Uh, I always feel like that there that has always been so much construction there. Um, also uh, connected here, if you just walk further down this way, is Mastro's Steakhouse. It's right there too. And then, of course, you have the convention center, which hails all the conventions. And this is uh, RuPaul's Drag Con. So usually when there's a big convention in town, people are going there. Or there's a big game in town, people are going there. And which is just kind of like right on the outskirts of downtown because all this is like downtown. Right? Would you call this downtown? Yes, it yeah. is downtown. Right, yeah. but we're like right on the outskirt of it because you can see all the other stuff. You're really close to Beverly Hills. You're really close to um, Santee Alley. You're really close to, what else? Give me some other. Every Orange County. Orange County, Disney, Universal, Palm Springs. Palm Springs. You're really close to everything here. So this is the basic room right here. Um, they call it an upgrade. Um, I feel like the whole theme of the hotel is the moxie is downstairs they have the moxie motorcycle that has like the thing next to it i'll show you later on in the video but you can see i have the chopper so these are like uh for motorcycles a chopper and then you have like a drop for the bicycles so it's kind of like that whole theme around motorcycles around like transportation and future transportation too because you can see here you have these little markings which if you know what that is, leave in the comments down below. Now, I could not for the life of me, me and her, could not figure out how to use these. They had, oh my God, I just figured it out. You just touch it. Oh, wow. We did that. Yeah, actually, we did do that last yeah, night. Did. I did do that last night too. I don't understand. There's a lot of hangers. So many freaking hangers are here. Oh, I don't understand. There's so many hangers. Um, and let me see here. We found the remote right here. It is a Marriott Bonvoy and I guess a Marriott there's Bonvoy. There's no name. Yeah, there's no name. That's interesting. Okay, so here is another marking right here. This is the little area to get ready. You have, you know, a sink. <laughs> and you have that pretty much it. The sink. Full body mirror, at least. This is the shower. And these are the brands of the soap in the shower. Uh, muck. Muck bang. Deep muck. That's what it says, Deep Muck, and Deep Muck Ultra Soft Conditioner, and Deep Muck Hair and Body Wash. So I've never heard of Muck, but for all the Muck people out there who do Muck Bangs, then you would really like that. Here is the restroom here, which is just a little toilet, which I'm not going to show you because look, Masbella blew it up. So here we go. Let me, can you hold this door? Yeah, real quick. I'm going to show it in the hallway. So let me see here. Now, they were like doing construction. Oh, look. This is what I kept hearing all night. I kept hearing this all night last night. It's like doing this construction or something. Because this hotel is brand new. It's only open for a week. Look at this beautiful view. If you guys know the area over here, you guys know. Look, beautiful view of LA. There's a man coming down. Wow. Oh, there it is right here. Shantae, this way. There's the convention center for the RuPaul's Drag Race. And there's already people outside there. And there's vendors selling food and things like that. And people are slowly trickling in. But we'll see. Um, what's really cool is that it has these little alien spaceships on the floor. You can see it right there. See, it has like this sci-fi 
theme alien vibe, which is so cute. Look. Okay, I'm going to also show you um, the lobby. And like I said, there's two hotels in one. So when you pull up, they say, are you staying at the AC Hotel or are you staying at the Moxie? And then you just let them know which one you're staying at. So here's the rooms. They all have these very interesting, like, almost like flippers. Like that. Um, the hotel is very clean. Everything's brand new. Carpet's new. The tiles, new. everything is like really, really new. The room I'm in is 3216. So if you want to stay in the room of a celebrity, you can stay in this one. This is the bed. Now, if you notice, the phone is an old, old school phone. I haven't done that in a while. <laughs> oh, my God. I love that. Here we go. Nice. What? What? Mas Bella, honestly, and it did get cold. I will say that. Where are you at, girl? In the bathroom. Okay, she's going to give us a review. So here's the little tile. It's like um. It was like a thick plastic. Okay. Now, she brought a lot of stuff, as you can see here. And this is all for one day. I said, hey, let's go to the hotel for one day. One night. Boom, 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 boom. And I'm like, why would you bring all this stuff? She said, well, I want to have options. You see, here we go. It says hit the road. And you have the motorcycle right here. So that's pretty cool. This, mo oh my gosh. That's cute. So it's all about like motorcycles and, and stuff. This hotel has like a cool, like edgy theme. Now I'm going to run down. I'm going to show you the lobby. Let me show you the view one more time. I'm going to show you the lobby of the, of the room. And what is this here? Oh, extra seating. Oh, wow. I didn't even notice that. Oh, I know you guys are going to say, I know you guys are going to say, oh guys, like there's no space to put your stuff. It's right here. They have these cubbies. They have these little <laughs> cubbies underneath. Did you use your cubby? Yes. Did you check if you left anything underneath there? Show them the cubby. See? And then did you know about this one on that side too? Oh, no. Watch. See? You have all that space. Oh. Mine, on my side, mine has a safe. Oh. Look. Let me show you. See? Ooh. Yeah, I'm just going to put that. There you go. Get in there. Okay, let me show you guys the lobby of the hotel. But before I do that, Mas Bella, we know we gotta do classic thumbnail. Look angry, hands on hip, hands on your hip. Give me that face, girl. There we go. Okay, I wanna know what what is your review of the room? Um, for the price especially, like I could do a hundred dollars in this room. But this was not no hundred. This is like four hundred, I think. Exactly. Yeah. For that, I would have to give it a one star. I did not get a good value for my money. And there were some indiscrepancies. Like they said we had access to the rooftop. There was no oh, access. Oh, I forgot to tell you. This whole this whole building is known for their rooftop pool and party. And she goes up there like, oh, it's only open on the weekends. Only. I'm like, oh, if I would have known that, I wouldn't have booked here. No. I would have went to the Ritz Carlton or JW Marriott if that was the case. Because I, I wanted, I booked here for that rooftop. It's very disappointing, and I'm going to be having to work with the management. Ooh. And when we were asleep, I did hear noises of them working and drilling and stuff like that. I did hear that. Um, the when you pull up, the guys who work valet are really cute. Front desk seemed kind of overwhelmed. However, I will say this: benefit of the doubt. This is a hotel that is a lot of the traffic is for conventions yeah. and sports. So you're going to get a lot of heavy, heavy traffic. So it's kind of hard to maintain that level of service. Yeah. You know, so if you're looking for really good, excellent, top tier service, go to the Ritz Carlton or JW Marriott, which is just right there. But here, it's just kind of like I'm going to check in and hit the road. And I'm going to go hang out with my friends. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? But I don't know why you would stay here if you're not going to the convention or the... Right. Because I, I would only stay here if I'm going to go to the convention or a game. Exactly. Yeah. But anyways, I'm going to try to show you the rooftop. I'm going to try to show you the lobby. So let me show you all that so you can get a good vibe. Here we go. Uh. 
look at the art. So, um, see a little hotel here. This is what I was talking about. Look, see this DT downtown LA Moxie, and then there's the motorcycle with the little buggy next to it kind of like Haggard's motorbike if you go to Universal Studios hey Mas Bella hello let me see what else they have here oh yeah this is the coolest thing here this is the Moxie and then here they have basically all these games let me see if I can get it here watch Let me exit out yeah you see these these are like systems look they even have dreamcast super mario um the last blast cough all the fighting games but basically it's an arcade that has systems sega genesis in here so much more if i can if i go back out there we go capcom games here we go dreamcast Look, Sega, Sega Genesis, Game Boy Color, Nintendo. I mean, it's all here. If I go to Super, Super Nintendo, look, it, and it shows you like games and everything. And then up there is a pinball machine. I think there's a restaurant up there too. But yeah, and here's the bar. Here's the ceiling, and then here's outside. Let me get my Prada bag. Okay, I'm gonna go up there to the front desk and complain because it was so noisy. Oh, look at this. Is this chess or checkers? Oh, that's so cool. What? Okay, here's the fitness center. Okay, you can hear the music's really good here. Really enjoy it. And here is the mechanical room. <laughs> How exciting. Thank you so much, Mas Bella. And then here we go. This is the little fitness center. You know, when you're in LA, you gotta have a snatch body, girl. This is a really nice gym. I'm really impressed. Wow. Oh my gosh. Look at these breathtaking views. Oh! Look, there's somebody here fixing the sign. You can see hard at work. Here's the uh, Shantae this way. There it is. That's super cute. Here's the gym. All right, I really like, oh, are these Pelotons? Uh, techno gyms, everyone's knocking that off. It's like Peloton was the first and then everyone's like, oh, okay, we can do it. Cheaper, faster, more efficient. Does that open up? Oh, no, it's danger. Oh, danger. There's a lot of construction here. The, you know what, this hotel should not have opened up yet. It, it's too soon. It's not ready yet. This is, you know, people love to stay at new places. But when you stay at places that are too new, new, um, it's, they're not, it's not ready for you yet. So you have a restroom here and you have a little another restroom for the men. You have this stuff right here. Let me see. Is it, there you go. That's pretty cool. Gotta fix my, hi guys. Hey guys. Towels only. Let me see. Is the water pH balance 8.5 yes. or higher? Let's see. How did you get it? You got, oh, you took off the plastic? Is that how you do it like that? Or is it the other way around? Sure. Okay. Ooh, thank you. Oh, it's not even cold. There's ice. Mmm. Do you want ice? Yeah, we, uh, now I'm, I'm just not interested anymore now. Now, yeah, it's like really stale. So weird. Okay, all right, let's get out of here. So, um, I, so apparently you can. There's no rooftop on the AC side, going to the top. No. The restaurant's closed up there. Under construction. Let's go see this construction. Let's. Go, I don't understand. I've literally seen videos of people there. Are there two restaurants I don't know about or something? Listen, babe, 
Hold on, let me see. Where where am I at? Okay, Moxie, look, right here. AC floor, 34th floor. We're going to this elevator. So now we're on the AC side of the hotel. Okay, you didn't come this way? No. This is what I was telling you about this whole time. Okay, here's a vending machine. This is the trick. You stay at the Moxie. Look, look at the room. They make it look real cute, girl. You stay at the Moxie. Here's the address. Okay, you stay at the Moxie. Then you come to the fitness floor, which is nine or eight or whatever it was. And then you come over to this side, you walk across, and now we're on the AC hotel side. Okay, look, totally, totally different vibe. Yeah. Two hotels in one. Definitely. Sky Lobby. Mas Bella, I don't know what hotel, you were going to the Moxie side restaurant. That wasn't ready yet. Actually, I had to go outside of the doors, mm -hmm. outside of the hotel, and then go all the way around is how they instructed me. So the, how they instructed me was take the Moxie elevator up to the eighth floor and then walk over like we just okay. did. And then here we are. Yeah, this, this is where I Okay, this is the check-in lounge. This is called Lola Lola. This is cute. Now there's like a view. This is, oh my God, this is so much more fabulous. I want it fresh there. Oh, this is so much more fabulous. Oh, I see what's going on. So here's the amenity deck, you see? Oh, wow. And look, it's not open. And this is the rooftop. What do you think of that? It's so pretty up here. Okay, cute. So now we did it all. And then here's the restaurant. Oh my God, there's a restaurant. Is it open? Yeah. Can we get it? Can we, can it, your drink ticket work here? <laughs> Morning. Wow. Oh, this is so cute. Mm -hmm. Okay, guys, I'm going to sit here and order some food. Let me know what you think about all that drama, and I'll see you guys later. Bye. Okay, guys, we're back in Mas Bella's 2028 Range Rover. It's so new. It hasn't even come out yet. <laughs> anyway, so this is the AC Hotel. As you can see, um, there's a lot of construction going on. So... It, just expect a lot of noise, a lot of construction, a lot of like kind of chaos a little bit. Um, you might like it. By the time you come here, none of the construction should, shouldn't be here. But see, it says AC Hotels on this side and it says Moxie Hotel on that side, um, which is cute. So you get two hotels in one. You also get several restaurants in one. And then the Mastro's is really down the street if you want to check it out. And yeah, yeah, and there's right across the street from the City of Lights on Figueroa, which is an apartment complex. And it, well, no, it's not called Stable Center anymore. It's called Crypto Arena. And then there it is. There's more people hanging out here. And the uh, convention's right there on that side. So here's, and there's a giant little billboard. So you can, and this like di changes different advertisements. And uh, there's the Crypto Arena. So you're, you got to see this from different angles. And then there's RuPaul's Drag Con right there. Uh, it seems like a lot of people aren't really like there yet, but so anyways. All right, guys, let me sign off. That was my review of the Moxie Hotel. Um, it's up for debate if I would stay there again or not. I don't know. You know what it kind of gives me? The Intercontinental Hotel on a budget. Oh, yes. Because of the views and everything. Very that. It gives me very that. So I think that's cute too. All right, guys, I'll see you in the next one okay here we are there's uh and Alyssa's secret it's a streaming now on wow present oh look at the little dolls oh it's pandora it's pandora la pandora pandora la pandora
Oh, look at that. The crochet. Oh, Jiggly, yeah, Jiggly Caliente is inside there, girl. She said... Rita Baga? <laughs> we gotta find it! Lady Boom Boom! Minty fresh. Mini Cooper. Mini Cooper. Oh, look at that cake. Look at the cake. Look at the Furby. The, the purple? No. Oh my God, it is a Furby. Oh my god. Look at that. Oh my god. I love it. It's a Furby girl. Oh. I love your look. You look incredible. Oh. Okay, guys. And we're back. Who is this? Nikki Daw and Raka Sakura. Oh my god. Look. Oh my god. That is such a beautiful. That is so be beautiful. I love everything about that. It's the creativity for me. Welcome to Sugar and Spice. You have to go in inside. Yes. Yeah. There's their hidden. They're hidden. Okay. Oops, no. Push through here. Lawrence Cheney. Lawrence, Lawrence Cheney's not bothered with. I, I think it's so funny, right? How, like, some people, they'll put a lot of money into a booth. No. And some people are like, girl, some people don't have to. I don't care. What do you mean? Like, Sugar and Spice could have been with a ring light, and their line would have been exactly. Let's the go same. over here. Exactly. That's what I'm saying. But they're trying to offer an experience. Blue Hydrangea. Muffy. Look, it's blue hydrate. Corazon. April. Heady on. Oh my god, Manila's here. There's Man. Wait, who is that? Oh, it's Manila. There's the dolls. Look at the dogs. There's the Manila dogs. And then and then there's Manila Luzon right there hanging out. I love Manila. So I want cute. A doll. Yeah. I know I would I want a doll too. Raja O'Hara. Join us, Drag Story Hour. 